What is up, FIFA Carpenters? Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for deciding to watch another video on the channel. If you're new on this corner, as you know how it goes, drop a like on this video, subscribe to the channel, and let me know if you're enjoying your FIFA experience at the moment. Big shout out to all the commenters. Big shout out to Riot. Big shout out to uh, Raris, who were the latest people to comment on the video. Much love to all of you guys out there. Thank you for supporting the channel. Now, moving on to the card we get on the screen. Today is the first day of the promo, Shapeshifter, and we get ourselves a player that goes by the name of Gerhard. His full name is Yannick Gerhard. Now, to complete this card, you will need to do the following. It's, it's going to have to happen in squad battles, unfortunately. You have to win eight matches in squad battles, minimum professional, with 11 Germans. So you'll have to play eight games in total. The next thing is you'll have to assist with the through ball using Bundesliga players in five separate matches. You'll have to assist five goals using German players in squad battles. This has to do to be done in world class. So if you could do them in world class as well, do that. That way it saves you the, the back and forth. And finally, you'll have to score eight finesse goals using a midfielder and squad battles on professional as well boys we get ourselves a sensational card listen if you weren't able to do uh, our good friend Ma uh, marcel schmelcher you have a great alternative right in front of you right here right now boys this guy is a german international who has played uh, most of his career in not most of his career, all of his career as a midfielder. Esports transitioned him into a left back position there. He's, in, he's a German international, like I said, and most of his career has been done at uh, in the Bundesliga. He's played for Köln, 74 appearances and a total, and now has been playing for Wolfsburg uh, and has done 148 appearances. What a, a sensational amount of, of, of appearances for a player that's only 28 years old. Moving on to the card, he's six foot tall. Six foot tall is very, very good. He is medium, medium in terms of work rates. Now, medium, medium for work rates for a left back that's a little bit of a red flag you gotta be fully honest that's a little bit of a red flag but you can apply a, 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 a what's it called an instruction on him stay back while attacking that is going to sort of dominate that is going to dominate the player work rates and that's going to save you now he's left footed sensational he's going to cross those balls and very early crossing with his dominant foot and he's not forget about what you see on screen here he is a four star skill three star weak foot so the skills is having is is not correct on the screen right here moving on to the player attributes what a sensational card we have right 96 acceleration 91 sprint speed for an overall 93 that is very very decent and this currency of the game that is fantastic everything is above 90 you're going to need to boost that up okay for multiple reasons and i'll tell you why the shooting on this card is very much there 88 attack positioning so he's going to do those runs very well he's going to finish if he's in, in a position to finish with that 85 he has a 92 shot power the boosted cannon like shot power of 90 plus is very much going to help he is uh also pretty good at the long shots with with 84 that is okay the rest is not non-existent the passing on this card is very good 92 vision combined with the 93 short pass the 80 the 89 long pass that is sensational the 81 crossing and the 81 curve that's a little sus that's a little sus that is a little sus which is why i am proposing you to you guys to convert this guy as a cdm you can play him as a left back. You can also play him as a CDM, but in a two CDM formation. He has the height. He has the work rates if you put a stay back while attacking. And he also has the passing to be able to support. The dribbling on this card is good. Very much good, but not nothing too insane, right? He is average body type and he only has 86 agility, only 83 balance at the current state of the game. That is quite low. When I said he's an alternative to Marcel Smelcher, Marcel Smelcher, Marcel Smelcher is way better, right? I said that name six times, but he's way better. But... Still, this is a good alternative. 92 reaction, 92 ball control, 90 dribbling, 84 uh, composure. That is all very good. Average body type. He is going to move decently well, but not incredibly well, right? This, this is why he's going to have to be a CDM or a left back stays in uh, stays in your defense line, right? The defending is cracked in this card. It's probably the most important highlight of this card. 89 interception, 92 defending awareness, 85 sand tackling, 90 slide tackling. That is fantastic, right? The heading accuracy is not very much there. The jumping is not very much there. The physicality, he does have 93 stamina, 91 strength, and 90 aggression. That is fantastic. He has zero player traits to discuss, zero whatsoever, and that's a little bit of a letdown. If he had, uh, you know, dive into tackle, if he had solid player, if he had playmaker, something like that, that would support a little bit of the stamina that we see over here but listen this guy is going to bring you a lot he has the height he has the size he has the pace but with players like this the pace is not really what you see he does look to have a lot of pace but in game he's not going to feel like he has 96 acceleration and 91 sprint speed you're gonna have to max that out if you want to play him on the wing you're gonna have to max that out if you want to play him on as a cdm you're also going to have to max out the dribbling as well i definitely need to see that dribbling 
boosted. So I, I suggest something like an engine, an engine on a card like this, right? The dribbling needs to go up, the pace needs to go up, and then it would boost the, the, pay, the passing a little bit more. The defending is already good, the physicality is already good. This is a card that is a great alternative for the Bundesliga, for if you have a German uh, side, if you have a Bundesliga side, if you're needing a center back, or sorry, a left back that you can convert into a CDM while uh, when, as soon as you start the game, this guy is a good alternative. He's four star skill, so he can dribble. Three star weak foot, he can't really shoot, and he can, uh, you know, he's not going to be that clean cut in front of the goal. But he's, you, you should never put him in a position to shoot. Boys, this is a decent card. I'm going to give this guy a small W. Let me know in the comment section below if you think I am accurate by saying that. Drop a like on this video. Subscribe to the channel. I absolutely love you guys' the support on the channel. The channel is growing every single day. If you would like to drop uh subscribe or like on this video you support a lot uh and i put a lot of work for you guys in. and if you notice i'm trying to put out content as early and as quickly as possible if you want to support that type of grind go ahead and do that catch you guys very soon in another video for another play review peace out boys